I've been painting on the streets for about 10 years, and it's, uh, I think that... Sort of like busking? It's a bit like busking. I think um, street art is a little bit like uh, when, when it snows and everybody makes snowmen, yeah. uh, it's kind of a very uh, harmless thing. And I think that in the, done in the right way, it's a, real, uh, it's a really powerful uh, social medium. During the commercial break, you expressed an opinion that you'd like to do my picture. But I'd I, love and you to. need me to stand I'd up. I'd love so to. I'm yes, going to try and please. do this without. Um, <laughs> there are those people, of course, who believe that all protesters are wearing. Are wearing skirts or something. All you go, are. Um, so, do I need to strike a particular pose stick? Um, that's lovely. You know, that's, that's great. Slightly, slightly yeah, imperial, I'm just going to get that. Yeah. That's very regal. Can you can you talk and draw simultaneously? Yes, I can. Okay. I can. I'm going to get your likeness here. Are you one of those artists who's actually quite a capable draftsman? I well, can you draw? That's properly? a matter of opinion. Yeah. <laughs> you um, yeah. I'm just trying to get your. Now you see, at the moment, that looks like. One of the pictures that my nine-year-old <laughs> uh, was doing yesterday at the dining table. Yeah. Um, how much can I get for what she does? Um, <laughs> <laughs> I know, maybe she needs an agent. Um, I try to capture the essence of somebody's uh, mannerisms uh, just in as few <laughs> lines as possible. Yeah. I think you've got very smiley eyes there. Oh, well, that's good. Tired eyes, there we stick. Go. Tired eyes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's quite early in the morning. And that's it. That's it? Wow. Yeah, that's it. I mean, I would start out with like this, and then I would like to go yeah. to a, a, I'd like to do it on a wall. Maybe I can do it on the wall of your uh, studio. Well, I tell you what, my editor's office is just in there. I think he's out this morning, so he won't mind if you do a bit of, uh, you know, graffiti all over his office, I'm sure. Um, uh, well, beyond the commercial proposition of flogging mm. art, mm. which is, you know, an art unto itself, what are you trying to communicate to people? Um, for me, it's very important that we're using uh, street art as a social medium where people are actually um, creating art in their communities by those communities. I do a lot of projects around, uh, around uh, the UK and I've been to other parts of Europe um, doing projects with communities where we get a permitted space uh, where people are allowed to go and paint and go and express their own um, artistic uh, their, their own pictures. Um, I spoke to... I actually bumped into Boris Johnson last week. On his bike? Um, no, he was just coming out of the tube, and I said, Boris, what do you think about street art? And he said, in the right place, I think it's beautiful. And wow. I think yeah. on the back of that, I think, I think what's important there, he says, in the right place. I think if we can get enough right places, I think that that would uh, solve the problem of um, unwanted graffiti. I think if there's a place where but we've, tr we, we've tried that before, haven't we, Stick? You know that, that idea of turning people who you know spray on the sides of r underground carriages and all that sort of stuff, and trying to galvanise that slightly aberrant form of art into something a bit more house trained. We've tried that before, uh, and you do get some impressive artworks, mm. but I'm not sure it always turns around the lives of the indiv individuals concerned. Maybe you feel differently. I, I think that um, I've seen. Um, I've seen so many success stories, and the communities that I've worked with have... Um, I, I've, I've been and uh, created these murals with the people in that community, been back a year later, and there's no unwanted graffiti in yeah. the area. Um, I did a project with uh, Tower Hamlets um, last year, and Michael Rowan, who run, ran the parks area, said that actually the unwanted graffiti in the area actually went down.